Last month, I had the opportunity to keynote at a conference called Women in Produce. I think they called it the Fresh Perspective Conference. And it was interesting because, first of all, I love produce. Who doesn't, right? I love those big, juicy Driscoll strawberries. And they were in the audience. And HEB was in the audience. It was a really, it was a great, great opportunity. And when I was finished, I partnered up and I made friends with several of the uh, several of the people. And they were, many of them were Gen Zs. And we made friends and relationships on LinkedIn. So I asked them if I could interview them. And it was interesting because throughout the interview, there was one theme that kept coming up. And the theme was um, how to really bring these new ideas into the workplace. See, these are young people. They've just gotten out of school. They're really, really excited. They're working in the companies. And now they want to make changes. And they want to make changes right away. And I asked a couple of them, so how do you do it? And, And they just said, we just try really hard to be tactful, but when we see something that needs a change, we actually jump in and we try to make a change. I started thinking about that. I started thinking like, ouch, you know, because all young people want to make changes. I I believe that most of us, when we get out of school and we get a job, we see all of the things that we've learned in school that we want to change. But the reality of it is, is many times people that have been there years, two years, 10 years, 20 we don't want to hear those changes, especially from somebody that's only been there for a month. There's an expression, take the cotton out of your ears and put it in your mouth. And that's really the message I'm trying to give today. Um, I was talking with a director and she said that she uh, had a new hire and she said, I'm going to let you come and sit in on the staff meeting. And she said, I'm letting you come in and I'm letting you sit there, but I don't want to hear anything. She said, it is a privilege to be invited to this meeting. And I think that we've got to begin to look at that, young people. When you get to an organization, when you get to a company or a new team, be quiet. Learn, keep your eyes open, watch how things are going, and don't start making those changes. Give it at least three to six months before you start putting your input in. And I think that you're going to find that people will receive you much better. It's short, it's sweet, but it's just a quick lesson from the road. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Karen McCullough. 